I am Randall Stevens, performance poet extraordinaire. Oh. It'll huff and puff and bust your fucking house in! Yeah! And uh, it's, it's a pleasure for you to be watching me. You can applaud now, it's okay. Yeah. It's, it's very difficult uh, being a poet. Um, we are just a few steps above the, the poverty line. Uh, there, there are a lot of barriers towards you know, improving your station in life, you know, all, the, all the free time you have. I do not like sports, music, reading, running, jogging, walking, yoga, Pilates, Tai Chi or any martial art, any form of exercise, physical or mental. The, the enormous amounts of sleep that I, that I need to get during the day make it difficult. I'm just constantly just you know barrage with with uh, young women poetry groupies who are constantly trying to have sex with me. I have a lot of uh, you know white middle class angst uh, to deal with. I don't know how much of it comes out in, in my work. I, I try to internalize. I'm as mad as hell and I'm not gonna take this anymore! That's right, get up! Get up out of your chair! I try to be, you know, stoic um, and, and artistic, but I, I think, I feel that you, you, can, you can sense it when you're around me. For every couple who had 72 places to be 45 minutes ago but said no, not until I get freaky with you. I think I've achieved yeah, a lot. Um, I, I've performed at uh, you know several venues. Um, I've had audiences of just, you know, just almost dozens of people. Um, I've sold some of my CDs. I, I just happen to have a, a copy of that CD here. Uh, it's called Product and it's available for $10 on consignment from several uh, stores around Melbourne or, or through uh, my, my website. Uh, this is a death of art but it won't matter because death makes life. This is the death of art and it's about to rain down black and burning. This is the death of art and me, I'm just hoping the scars. <laughs> yeah. Meaningful relationships with women are, are, are not conducive to writing poetry. Uh, I, I don't get the chance, well, I, 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 I choose not to cultivate a, uh, in any one relationship. To, to be a poet is to explore, you know, sex and, and death and pain. And, and one must be, uh, you know, polyamorous in order to, to fully achieve this. It, I know the palm of my hand like the back of my hand from all those nights I waited in hope. I learned to speak, thought conversation would be important, then had to learn how not to speak when I became the guy you had intense conversations with before you went to just fuck someone who was more fun. The relationship between a poet and Centrelink is a very, it's, it's a very deep and prof profound um, dynamic, much as a, uh, a worshipper to a, to a temple or a, you know, a, the, the complex relationships between say a wolf and a badger out in, out in the wilderness. I'm, I'm quite, quite poor, so you have to buy my product. Shut up! Hey, twenty dollars, okay? What? How am I today? How? Fuck cats! I, I hate cats. What? What is the how of that? I don't care if the other guy will work for fifteen, twenty. Hey, no, twenty. Food? Yeah, you got food. Twenty. Come on. That's. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, cool.